hello fish friends uh, hope you all doing fine uh, I hope you enjoying the aquarium behind me I will do a full video on all the equipments and fishes that I am using behind this tank uh, this tank is housing currently about 15 discus and angel six uh, pleco one bristle nose for a mano shrimp and a lot of inhabitants so in fact uh, I'm overstocking the stock uh, uh, tank and have a uh, seven small uh, baby juvenile discuss three months old I've overstocked this tank but uh, this is basically a no filter tank I uh, sorry this is a basically no water change tank it's uh, unheard of in a discus world where they don't change water usually in discus world they change water every day 100% water change uh, I will do a detailed video on how I set up this tank in a future video uh, stay tuned look at these beauties <clears throat> Usually you will not see uh, small discus with uh, grown up uh, discus. Actually you will be surprised to know the reason. The reason is not because the adult discus might harm the little discus, <laughs> but it's actually the other way wrong because uh, discuss at this stage they still kind of peck on the slime coat <clears throat> so you notice as these adult discuss are so docile they do not harm uh, discuss of this size so what they do is uh, these little fella they might start <clears throat> picking on the slime coat of the adult discuss and cause them stress that's one of the main reason you don't put uh, you don't mix uh, discus of this size with bigger ones <clears throat> but for some reason mine uh, did quite well I guess uh, it's because I, I, I feed them a lot <laughs> and also I have about uh, 12 to 15 adult discus in this tank I think that uh, see, 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 he's pecking on the discus <laughs> Okay, she's getting a bit angry but not doing anything. You see that? <laughs> you see him? Hey, you want to peck, peck on her slime foot? No, I don't want you to peck on my slime foot. <laughs> this is ball, by the way. Uh, this is my <clears throat> mama discuss for all the red discuss that I have in my tank. I love this guy with the nice peppery. He looks awesome. Fishy, fishy, fishy. You all are hungry, isn't it? Isn't it? You want food, isn't it? <clears throat> and this is one of my angel. <clears throat> Gentle giant. Big angel. Doesn't disturb anyone. Doesn't allow anyone to bully him as also. Uh, he's got a yellow marking on the head but for some reason he's called the he's called the red cap uh, angel it's a male I used to breed uh, angels before uh, but I I had too many fries at, at one moment that I had to sell them I had to sell the breeding pair along with the fries and I just kept this guy here I love him <coughs> This is carrot, carrot, uh, and uh, my other breeding pair, tomato. They are both sisters. They came from the same batch. Carrot is a big, big female. Tomato is a smaller one.
But it's hungry, isn't it? <laughs> this guy Sunshine has a very very interesting story. Sunshine is uh, from a golden uh, bear, which which is actually a pair of uh, yellow discus. I call them uh, lemon and peach. So lemon and peach gave birth to about uh, fifty fries. Um, I didn't have room for that, so I had to sell that breeding pair with fries. So the owner came and and picked up the the, the pair and all the fries. And it was a bare bottom time with, with the minimum uh, decorations, but for some reason, uh, sunshine was missed. I remember the buyer double checking the tank, I double checking the tank, and after the buyer left, this guy just popped out of nowhere. <laughs> so he was left from that batch. Hello, sunshine, how are you doing? You're doing good, aren't you? If you find my video good, like, share, subscribe as you should. Hopefully YouTube will monetize them in two years uh, and I can buy fish food. I'm rhyming this video because it's directed my daughter as it would. If you like my video...